I swear to God, man, everything's not going to plan right now. So this spot is a hit or miss, you know, you gotta go in when someone goes in. So a long time ago on TikTok, I was actually scrolling through my friend's account on who he follows. And this one person named Jed, I saw that he was following me. So out of curiosity, I checked out his page, who he was, and he had some cool ass stuff on his TikTok. But what got to my surprise was that his Instagram, his photos, you know, they were super insane. And it was just stuff that I really enjoyed. And I also saw that he had a YouTube. So naturally, I went on his YouTube and to my surprise, he does engineering and cinematics at the same time. Now, most of you guys know that I'm an engineer as well. Well, at least I call myself a failed engineer, but whatever. And I do like making videos more than anything. So to see Jed do that kind of inspired me to like keep doing what he's doing. So naturally, I reached out telling him like, hey, I would love to do a video YouTube video with you if you ever up for it. And he responded and he definitely wanted to do one. So on Friday night, well, Saturday morning, he hit me up at 1 a.m. and took up on my offer to show around LA. So this is what happens from now. You vlogging? You, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I don't have it. a plan for vlogging, literally. It's just running gun. Yeah, I know. Push it slowly. Full send it. There you go. We made it. <laughs> what's, your, what's your setup? What's your setup? Uh, Canon EOS R 24 to 72.8, and I just got this road from a guy who wanted me to sponsor him. No oh, kidding. Yeah, got it for free. Sick. It was Very from nice. TikTok. Team well, watch the camera. Use the actual quality. Yeah, you're right. There. Uh, just like I was saying in the car, man, when shit goes unplanned, that's when you have to deal with that situation, and we made it. The lady who let us up here was super nice, so I'm grateful for her. I wish I recorded that. But no. What you think of it so far? That's sick, man. I've hey, heavy pack before. It was good for an unplanned event. That's hey, for sure. That's gonna land right here. It's not. It's not. <laughs> right now, is they're trying to get a drone shot right now. Philip is doing his thing with the drone. He has a Mavic Air too, which I'm trying to buy next. And I'm just happy that I finally met up with Jed. Brought him to a spot that you know I like to see. I wish I brought him to the spot that Walter lets me go up to. But that's just another story for a time. That's another story for another time. So hopefully we don't get caught. If we do, we'll just get kicked out. It's behind the scenes of what they do. I don't know what the goal of this vlog is, but like I said, just go with it. I see, yeah, this is real nice. It's perfect. Behind the scenes of an Instagram model. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care if I don't get photos of myself, you know. I look like shit today. I didn't give myself a haircut, whatever. Yeah. Like I said, I was just trying to fit the ninja aesthetic because I wasn't trying to get caught. I'm zoning out. <laughs> shit. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome to Eric's vlog. This is the famous Jet. This is the famous Eric. <laughs> you know, I discovered him first. I, I was on TikTok. That's true. And I was looking up like secret LA spots and this guy always hooks it up. What I do like about like getting to meet Jed is that he's like a big YouTuber. In my opinion, I'd say he is. And like just seeing everyone else do like their work of how they do the YouTube work pushes me more. But just to see like how he does things, that's what helps me out get better and get out of my comfort zone. One of the things that I still struggle with is like just vlogging in public. So like seeing him do his thing like really inspires me. And that's a wrap. Security guard was chill about it. Didn't want to show that part because what if he didn't want to come out and film? But yeah, pretty chill, pretty cool. We're done. To my surprise, Jed was super fucking cool. Like I didn't expect him to be that funny in person too. And you know, he recommended me this good ass boba drink. I had so much fun, you know, just meeting Jed in general. And I, I cannot wait to do more stuff with him. But the fact that I got to hang out with him and see like what he does for his YouTube videos inspired me. But not only that, but a lot of you guys know how much I disliked engineering because I felt like a total failure. But watching his video, especially his recent one, which is um, how he got bored so he made a website, it really inspired me to keep chasing software engineering. That's what I like. I love programming so much ever since like I took that class a second time. The first time I took coding, I failed. But the second time I was like, wow, I'm this fucking stupid. Why did I not pay attention to it? But anyways, the point is, Jed fucking inspired me. And just being around him and his friends, you know, it was just... A refreshing feeling so I guess the point of this video is surround yourself with people at least for me like Jed that motivates you to do better and to continue pushing yourself because if he's working twice as hard I could do it as well so Jed if you're watching this 
I appreciate you, man. And I can't wait to hang out for the next time. Other than that, guys, go out there and create. Have a good one.